Yes, welcome to this portion of It's a Great Day for Business Atlanta! <laughs> Normally, this is the member spotlight section, but what we're doing is spotlighting the team of It's a Great Day for Business Atlanta. And yes? Yeah, I like that idea. You like that? Okay. We're going to do a little something different because we actually have a different format coming up. But what we want to do is just take this time to let you, know, the audience know how we've gotten benefit from being a part of It's a Great Day for Business Atlanta because a lot of people, when I go to different networking groups, they want to know, you know, what, what do you guys do? What is that thing all about? So what we're going to do, all of us here, a part of the core team. So who better to tell you the benefits of joining our awesome, incredible group than these people up here? So who wants to start? I'll start. I'll start. President and CEO yeah, well, yeah. of It's a Great Day for Business, Inc., <laughs> Louis Segudo. Yes. I, you know, I, I don't I get think, excited whenever I, I say that. I'm uh, just saying. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm glad you yeah, You look like a CEO, you too. I mean, great you, hair you. and all that. Oh, wow. Yeah. All right. Well, yes. <laughs> but we digress. Um, <laughs> the value that people don't understand, and I think it's a concept that they're, 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 they're afraid of video. Mm. They're afraid of a little camera recording what they do on a, on a regular basis, networking. Now, when you go to a networking event and you do a, a meetup or you go to an expo or something like that, you're talking to one person. The value here is that recording, there's an audience here, the audience will hear you, but now you're gonna have a video that you're going to be able to take a unique URL and put it on LinkedIn, send it in an email blast, use it on Facebook, and it will set you apart from other people. And one of the surprising, th the surprising aspects that I wasn't aware of that once I started doing that, my network grew much faster than just doing regular networking. Wow. I was getting comments from people that I didn't know, but they saw the video because it was, po because it was posted. So, you know, I think if you're not doing video, then you're not doing all you can do to grow your business. And that's the that's what's been effective for me and for the group as a whole. I appreciate that. Lori, we missed you last show and I was crying. Yes, I was crying real tears. So what, what, what's your thoughts? Because um, one of the things that I really enjoy about what you do is relationships. And we have a good relationship. I like it. That's why I was crying. So what's your thoughts? Yes, yes. Well, I'm going to kind of touch on what Lewis had said because that's basically the vein I was going to go in as well. Um, we all go to meetups. We all network, whether we're networking at the grocery store, depending upon our product, or we're networking at a meetup location. But the reality is, is you're only touching just that one person. And in order to effectively network, or networking like a pro, Brian Hellyard's book, um, is... You have to touch as many people as possible and you have to be as transparent as possible. And when I say transparent, I mean not only in who you are and what you stand for, but also in the vein of people being able to find you. When I have a meeting with somebody, I Google them. I want to find out what they're involved in and who I'm dealing with because depending upon who I'm dealing with, I have to deal with them on a different level. Not everybody likes, you know, part A of my personality. I may have to switch it up a little bit depending upon who I'm talking to and the level of uh, their success. You know, I have to bring mine up a little bit as well. And if I can Google them and see that what they're involved in, like Stacy just did a video um, promoting a little bit about herself, but also promoting what New York life is about. That is really being transparent in where your concerns and your cares are, and people can relate that to you, and I think that's very important. So that's what I got. <laughs> what do you think, Tracy? Well, I'm just going to share some, some great testimonies, Randall. Um, I've just been involved with the, uh, this meet meetup for just a few months, and I just took some steps out there to uh, post the videos that we've done on LinkedIn. 
And actually, I've only posted one video, I have to be honest, on LinkedIn because I'm just new to that. I've posted a few on Facebook. But from the one post of the video I did on LinkedIn, I got a call, uh, actually an email from someone that saw the video and she said, I need to know more about what you do. And I saw the video on LinkedIn. Now, I'd been posting on Facebook and um, getting some incredible feedback from that. But this particular person from that just one LinkedIn uh, post has actually partnered with us. She has absolutely changed our whole dynamics of our business. It was an incredible, incredible connection. I'm very, very grateful for what this, uh, what this has done for me. Wow, that's awesome. You know, one of the things that I really appreciate is the fact that woven into our show is the fact that this is probably one of the few places where I've seen extremely good teamwork because there's a lot of work that goes into producing this. And one of the things that I encourage people to do, look at the videos, those are good, but to actually come into the room yes. and see our setup and all of the stuff that we do, everything here really is an educational process. And I'm really big into learning. In fact, that's why we have books that we ask people about all the time because business for business sake is good, but all of us really want to make progress. And really, it's a great day for business in Atlanta. We do some of the same things all the time. But one thing that I noticed, I'm going to give you a perfect example. We had a guest on the show who saw a video from one of her clients who this guest who was on the show didn't even know about It's a Great Day for Business Atlanta. So her client posted a video, she watched the video, she said, oh my goodness, I need to join that thing that they're doing. She didn't know what it was. She came here, and by virtue of her coming here, she talked about a book that she suggested that people get. It was called The Millionaire Messenger. Now just to show you the dynamic of this, I was listening to that video and I listened to what everybody says here. You never know who's listening to what you say. I got that book and that book was probably one of the most incredible books that I've ever gotten and I've, I probably have about 70 books in my library to be honest. I got the book, got the CDs that go with the book and actually in there is a framework for what all of us can do to send our message into the world. Because there's so many people, like these people we have up here, for instance, we've got Success Magazine. Well, on the front of the October Success Magazine is John Maxwell. A lot of people will say, if I wanted to get involved with sharing my message, just like John Maxwell is a leadership expert, there's never been a book that talked about how do you go through that process? Because I've looked and I haven't seen it. So this guy, Brandon Bouchard, in his book, The Millionaire Messenger, which was mentioned, I never knew about it until I heard it on the show. That's a clue. I bought it, and the answers to a lot of things that people right here in our team are wondering about, like where do we take this, is in that book. That's incredible. And so that's, what, that's the testimony that I have, and it's really just paying attention to the things that are around us in life, like this show, different people's comments will change your life. Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, one more quick thing, and this is what I love about it too. I not only post my videos, but when I build relationships with people that come to this meetup, I'm out there promoting them as well. So I'll post someone else's video on my web, on my Facebook page. I've done that with uh, Stephanie there. And um, she posts on hers so that we're exposing each other. And that's pretty exciting. We're building some great relationships you know, here. I'm thinking about that now that you mentioned that, I've seen your videos. Because uh -huh. what happens is that there's a synergy when people watch videos on Great Day TV, YouTube.com mm -hmm. forward slash Great Day TV. <laughs> you can see who actually has watched your videos. And then it'll, it'll show, you know, this person has subscribed. So what's good is to subscribe to other people right. who subscribe to you. And then you keep the community going. Mm -hmm. There's a whole lot of free stuff that's involved with this. Um, if you'd like more details, because we got to close it up now, go to itsagreatdayforbusiness.com and join our meetup. Go to that website, click the meetup icon, and also subscribe to youtube.com forward slash greatdaytv. And thank you for joining us here on It's a Great Day for Business Atlanta. <laughs>